welcome to yet another of my video reviews. First of all, sorry that I haven't made a video in a while. Just laziness and really lack of things to review. I was going to review this. Yes, a just a generic 900,991 generic LCD game. Yeah that everybody else has reviewed and in my videos I wanna focus on reviewing things that really nobody else has really reviewed yet so and also school has begun so if you into mathematics you probably are going to get one of these yeah a graph calculator but it is not only a calculator also works as a pretty decent gaming device and that aspect I'm going to review a day so yeah this is a TA84 one of the most po popular calculators that are out there yeah so you can just use move the map top or you can this is a gaming device, so let's begin looking at the device. Has pretty many buttons, of course. Um, screen is a black and white dot matrix LCD screen. Uh, batteries, uh, four triple A's that run pretty well what I've heard really haven't had this so long but and yeah it has the USB port so you can put your games in and if many people request I may be making a tutorial on that and this is just a IO port for just other communications with other calculators uh, specifically older models and it comes with this plastic cover which I'm pretty the wrong way like that so you hold it like that <laughs> just turn it on you get this prompt yeah so yeah let's show some games uh, <laughs> some games require the mirrored OS operating system which I'm started up right now uh, by holding on and pressing apps it's a shortcut that Mirage OS installed in the system see that we got good lightning here yeah it's getting dark outside in the fall here in Finland ah too much talking let's get into the game Mario of course everyone everybody wants to see Mario. Let's see in on the screen. Yeah, maybe I could that out. Select your levels. Uh, there are like level packs that you download, and it has an editor so you can make levels yourself. So the buttons you just hold it like this, and the colored buttons are like your action buttons in most cases. And as you can see how fantastic it is the graphics the only thing is the screen that it flickers like because it can't keep up with the motion it's not really made for gaming these games are made by community programmers really uh, yeah so very smooth really fluid really doesn't lag at all and it, this Mario game has all the Mario aspects the mushrooms all power-ups is a little bit glitchy but yeah it has also a level editor uh, I can show it how do you quit this uh, yeah you have a level editor so you can make your own levels and with the cable share them with your friends in school Next up, Mega Man 83. And there's no sound 
this device so yeah you see a short story Mega Man 83 uh, yeah pretty lame bosses let's pick this one what's this Anchorman yeah the names are very creative and yeah this is not one of the best games here so look it's good it has only aspect of Mega Man you can get your you get the new weapons you can change weapons uh, it has e tanks and bosses and everything just look it's just blend slow boring repetitive yeah and who the hell decided to put the quit button right next to the jump button so if you by mistake press the mode button uh, it quits the game and you lose all your unsaved progress okay let's look at some cooler games doom okay so yeah also 3d works in a calculator it's not like full 3d but still very impressive there was another Doom game that looked better, but I couldn't get it working. But this one, hella cool. Just a little bit gets boring pretty quickly, but it's very cool to show off your friends. I'm getting raped here. Yeah, you spam the buttons. <laughs> I didn't even manage, never managed to beat the first level. Uh, okay, I want to show you the best game on here. Okay, come on. Load. Um, Tetris. Tetris Maradon. This game is awesome. It looks and feels just like the Game Boy version. It has drop shadows. And the screen is only monochrome, so... It gets the gray scales by quickly flickering the screen so it looks like it has the gray color. And I'm playing through the camera screen so I'm not doing really well here. But still, this game is awesome. It's pure awesome, Tetris awesomeness. Yeah, it's just like the it's just Tetris, nothing else. And there are probably about ten different Tetris versions to the Texas calculator. So yeah, but this one is the best for. It's only compatible with the TI eighty four. Okay, too much talking. Okay, um, I actually recently put some games here just for this sake of the reviews. Uh, you do not have infinite memory here at it comes with some apps that you can remove that some quits apps that you don't use this is your snake game you only use left and right to move around pretty cool <laughs> it's actually pretty hard and then i put pong let's just e oh i selected yeah just pong it works pretty well, it's everything is smooth. Yeah. Quit that. Yeah. Quit. And then I quit out the mirror shows because some games just install as a regular application here in the so first bubble bubble. Yeah. This game is pure awesomeness. Oh, it didn't begin from the beginning and start a new game here only bad thing about this every other game i played on here jumps with the second key and this whatever action shooting with the alpha key but why did they put this the other way around why it just otherwise it has everything the original bubble bubble has it's everything you can shoot all the enemies all the power-ups and stuff. I have really not play much bubble bubble This is just pretty awesome. Look how smooth it is really you wouldn't think a uh, calculator 
just just for mathematics can play games this well. Only thing the screen won't keep up with the motion. That's the only bad thing what I can say here. Otherwise, really excellent. And some games also have a teacher key that makes the screen blank. I don't know if this game has. No. So when your teacher comes by, the screen gets blank. So it's like pauses the game so you can quickly resume and your teacher, and teacher won't notice anything. Okay. So YouTube has increased the time li limit to 15 minutes. So I can still show you one game. Mega car. Yeah. So just comes with a couple of tracks. Do you have to put on there? And whoa, this is amazing. Physics are just excellent. Only thing the graphics are a little bit blend. But otherwise really good. Uh yeah. So this is it. The TI eighty four as a gaming device. Really, I would say this pretty good actually. But the price, if you don't need this, don't don't get it just for gaming. Because yeah, cost one hundred and twenty nine, hundred and twenty around. So, 120 euros around, so yeah, pretty expensive. But if you need to get one for school, you should definitely just plug with a standard. It doesn't look like a standard USB A plug or USB mini, but it is. So, you can, I maybe if you want, I'll do a tutorial that I tell you anything everything about this how you put games and how the memory thing works but i give this five out of five it's excellent gaming device only thing the screen and the buttons can be confusing so you had to go through reading the readme files to understand how to what the controls do but really comfortable grip everything is just great about this as a gaming device what else I had to say? Yeah, about future videos. I don't know if I, I will make any future videos. I will probably make, but it can take some time because really I'm too lazy to make, and school is pretty, pretty hard, and yeah, not, not much cool work. But yeah, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and. Yet, I haven't been so very active on Twitter, but still, you can follow me there, I will tweet every now and then. Yeah, and also, I'm in Finland, and, like, I had this first as a personal YouTube channel, but, yeah, and, and I had some old videos, uh, remixes, like, kind of early YouTube poop kind of thing is on my channel that I deleted because they were so bad uh, they were so bad so yeah my channel total video views doesn't count really take like about 500,000 away of that and also if I I favorite kind of random Finnish videos because there's a guy in Finland called Marco Repairs that's He's like, he's really wicked and funny, so yeah, if, if you don't like mind, you can like edit your subscription to not include uh, videos that I favorite, but I, <laughs> I'm too lazy to make another YouTube channel, I keep this as my personal and like regular to put up videos uh, YouTube channel, so just accept that. Yeah, nobody is forcing you to watch any of my videos that I favorite, so yeah. Thank you and bye bye and thanks for watching.